Well, there are lots of artists in Central Illinois that create a variety of work, from paintings to portraits, but finding a place to display and sell them, it can be a challenge. It's why a unique gallery concept in Tuscola is getting quite the attention, and that's where we find our Ryan Burke right now. Hey, Ryan. Well, hey, Heather, who would have ever guessed that a former bank in downtown Tuscola would become home to such an incredible variety of artistic pieces? And the best part is they're all from local artists. What makes it really neat, too, is the fact that it's owned and operated by the artists themselves. Take a look. Walk into the vault in Tuscola, and you never know what you're going to see. From carving designs into rock... This sketching in colored pencil, you never know what you'll find. And that's the goal. We have all kinds of different artists. We have a lot of painters, a lot of jewelers. We have people working in pottery. We have photographers. We have people working in fibers next door to us. It's an amazing group of artists. Joanna Drost is a potter and helps run the gallery, a unique concept that benefits everyone. The artists are now running the place, so it's an artist-run business. In order to be an artist here, you buy a share that makes you a sort of voting member, and then you sort of are able to kind of maybe select a place where you want to show your work. Uh, you pay rent or you're on consignment, and we add you to our family uh, of collective. A collective that gives artists a place to showcase and guests a place to discover the best of the local art scene. Phil Strang is known for his paintings on glass. Working with other creative artists is something he says helps inspire him. I mean, we have about, probably about 45 artists right now, and it does cover an entire range from sculpture to painting to drawing to photography to, uh, to soap to, you know, almost anything you can imagine. The gallery also keeps artists from having to travel. I've been on the road all my life with my wool things, mm -hmm. and um, it was just very nice being able to come into a store with a storefront that people can come into that I don't have to pack the car and go and pack the car go home. A great place to do some true one-stop shopping. It's, a, it's an amazing place to come just to see all the different types of art. And it's an amazing place to come if you're looking for something special, uh, whether it's Mother's Day or whether it's Father's Day or whether it's Christmas. A one-of-a-kind destination showcasing the best of Central Illinois creativity in a central location. Just such a great place there to get inspired and see everything that they have. And it's amazing, too, how it inspires other stories. You may have seen those really cool dog pictures that there at the end of the story. Those were really neat. They piqued my interest. And so we're going to have a story about that coming up in the coming week because I just had to find out how they do it, and I'll explore it. But, Heather, first, I think I'm going to have to make another lap around here because they have so many cool things I need to check out. Might uh, come home with some <laughs> new stuff for the weekend. <laughs> Maybe a, a dog painting for your apartment. I just might. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thanks, Ryan. Safe travels home.